The film begins with a truck driving through the desert. There we see Mexican foreign workers in the truck. They had their own life and ambitions. There we see a man named Moises among them. Moises had a teddy bear in his hand which belonged to his child. Its alarm was playing continuously. But Moises does not know how to stop those sounds. Then a man sitting adjacent to him says. Just press its tummy, it will be turned off. Moises does the same. He presses that teddy bear's tummy. As a result, it gets turned off. Those Mexican migrant workers wanted to cross the US border illegally. So that they can have promising lives in the US. But their truck gets broken down before reaching the border. Then the driver asks them, is there anyone among you who can repair the truck? Is there any mechanic? Then Moises raises his hand saying, yeah. I am a mechanic. Then Moises begins to examine the truck. Then he tells the truck driver that its engine has gone out of order. Repairing the engine was out of the question. All migrant workers had to go on foot as they had no option. So all workers begin to walk to the border of the US on foot. There we see razor wires placed on the border. Crossing those wires they reach into the US. On the other side, a truck is seen in the same area. There we see a man named Sam inside the truck, he was taking an alcoholic drink. Sam also had a dog, and the two were good friends. He had come to hunt a rabbit for the lunch. So he fires his rifle to hunt the rabbit. All Mexican migrants begin to run to save their lives, hearing the firing. Because they know that they have come here unlawfully. The heat was scorching in the whole desert. After some time, they begin to feel thirst. Being exhausted, they begin to have rest, sitting at a place. After some time, they move ahead towards their destination. Then Sam is shown stopped by US military officer. The police officer asks Sam, have you drifted? Sam replies, no. I am here to hunt the rabbits. And I don't think any authorization is needed to hunt the rabbits. The police officer says to him, no. The matter is not such. You should keep away from the border. Sam, says to the police officer, I have heard a news that, Mexican migrants intruded into the USA unlawfully, passing this way. The police officer says to him, I did not hear such news. Later, the police officer leaves from there. And Sam also moves ahead to hunt a rabbit. He finds a handkerchief there. And he lets his dog sniff it out. And he orders his dog to find out about them. Hearing it, the dog runs in that direction. There we see Mexican migrants moving towards the US crossing the border. As that handkerchief belonged to one of the migrants. Sam also follows his dog. He observes that a few Mexican migrants have entered the US unlawfully. But five of them hide secretly. They also request others to stop. But they don't stop. As they are aware that there is a threat in that area. So they wanted to move from there as soon as possible. But five migrants who were hiding glimpse Sam. They hide themselves seeing him as he is an American. They see Sam taking a rifle from his vehicle. Sam starts to kill them one by one. He kills all the migrants, aiming at those who are present at that place. They were running berserkly to save themselves. But they were alone in that vast desert. They could not go anywhere to escape. Sam kills everyone within minutes. Here it is revealed that Sam is a psycho. He killed a number of people as he is mentally unstable. He feels satisfied after killing them. He thinks, he has done the best. After it, he orders his dog to get in the car. Because he wanted to leave that place. However, the dog refuses to board the vehicle. It just stands there barking and looking towards the mountains. Sam understands that all Mexicans were not dead, observing it. A few of them have still remained alive. They were the companions of those dead people. He examines them through his rifle's telescope. He sees some people through it. He moves towards that direction where he had seen those people. He chases them. First, he sends his dog after them. When those five migrants sense that someone is chasing them, they also begin to run. But that dog catches one of the five migrants. And it kills him on the spot. It runs after the four survivors after killing him. All migrants climb up a tree before that dog reached them. As a result, that dog did not get access to them. 
At the same time, Sam also reaches there. He climbs up the tree, taking his rifle. All four survivors were running to rescue themselves. While that dog was chasing them from another route. Then those four survivors reach a place, which was an edge of a ditch. There was a big rock across that ditch. It means they had to move from one rock to another rock by jumping. So they begin to jump one by one. But the last one is scared among them. He was not getting the courage to cross it. But death was behind him. If he does not jump, that dog will kill him coming from behind. So he jumps gathering some courage. Unfortunately, his jump was not perfect, as a result, he starts to slide from the rock. Moises rescues him before he could fall. He catches his hand firmly. Moises attempts his best to pull him upward. Then Sam approaches there and targets them with his rifle. He fires his gun on that man who was swinging. That man falls down due to a bullet shot. Later, he also fires on Moises. But Moises doesn't get any bullet shots. Moises escapes from there, taking his two companions. But Sam and his dog pursue them. They were still chasing them. That dog was very smart, it used to follow each order of Sam. It could sense where those people were hiding. It used to go there accompanying Sam. Three survivors try to escape from there, holding the rocks. Whereas, Sam and his dog were also chasing them through the support of the rocks. Then Sam reaches that spot where the three of them were present. But Sam could see one of the three. That man falls down when Sam begins to fire. And the dog was waiting for him at the surface. And that dog bounces on that person. Then Sam comes there and puts him to death after firing his rifle. Now only two survivors had left. They were hiding at the same place. One is Moises while another one is a girl. Both hide behind the rocks to rescue themselves. As a result, Sam could not see them. All of a sudden Teddy starts to play which was present in his bag. Taking out from his bag Moises hurriedly turns it off. Sam and the dog suspect that there is someone else in that place. But they leave from there without catching them. Adela is the name of the girl who is accompanying Moises. Adela and Moises both go ahead, leaving that place. As it was getting dark they both take a rest sitting at a place. Adela, tells Moises, I never wanted to leave my country. My parents used to think that my country was not secure from me. They wished that I may move to the US forever to spend the rest of my life. So they sent me to the US along with a man. She tells, that man also died with whom I came here. Moises, tells her, my family resides in USA and my family is still waiting for me till today. He reveals that they actually used to reside in the USA unlawfully. One day a headlight of someone's car was damaged by him. As a result, he was captured by the police. Then it was decided that, he should be deported to the prison of Mexico. My younger son came to meet me when I was being sent. The teddy bear that he was holding, was actually given to him at that time by his son. I promised my son that I will come again and give him this teddy bear. Later, he was deported to Mexico. Now he wants to return back to his family, and he also wants to return the teddy bear to his son. Now Sam is seen sitting in the desert to pass the night, lighting the campfire. There was scorching heat in that desert during the day. As a result, Sam decides that he will leave from there the next day. As he could not get the courage to bear that heat. When Sam was trying to leave that place. Adela, notices him. And she informs Moises about Sam. When Sam was about to move from there. His dog which was sleeping wakes up suddenly and begins to run in that direction, where Moises and Adela were present. Sam also goes after it, holding his rifle. Reaching there, they find the teddy bear of Moises. It was playing some music and the voice of a baby was coming from it. Sam comes to know that both survivors have played a trick to fool him. Then Sam looks at his truck. He observes that both survivors were running towards his truck. Sam starts to fire his rifle from a distance. But the target gets missed. Now Sam's dog runs towards the truck. Reaching the truck, Moises tries to open it. They both get into the truck opening its door before the dog reached them. Moises starts the truck and they both drive from there. Moises says, we will escape from here and no one can seize us. Suddenly, 
Adela receives a gunshot, due to it, the truck loses its control. As a result, it gets crashed and remains in the upside down position. But Moises does not get any harm during the accident and he remains unharmed. Moises takes Adela near a tree and makes her sit under the tree. He also brings a medical kit with him. When he opens the medical kit, he finds a rifle there. He says to Adela, I am going to leave you alone as you are wounded. And you cannot walk. Adela requests him, don't go leaving me here, as that man will kill me. Moises says, he will kill both of us if I stay here. He again tells, I have a family, a son and I need to return to him. Moises takes that gun and goes away leaving Adela. On the other side, we see Sam also reaching that place. But he could not find them. Now he moves to that place where Adela was sitting. He notices the light of a flare gun before he reaches Adela. Moises had fired the flames through it, as he knows that Sam and his dog approach Adela. Sam, says, leave that girl. As she will not survive for a long time, go to that place where that man is present. Sam's dog listens to his orders and starts running towards Moises. Moises was hiding inside a dead bush. He fires the gun on the dog when it comes near to him. Consequently, that dog gets injured. Moises goes from there. After coming there, Sam observes that his closest friend dog is taking its last breath. This prompts Sam to take its life. Sam becomes very aggressive due to it. Then Sam follows Moises. He glimpses that he is climbing the mountain. Sam begins to target him. Sam climbs on a big rock. Moises also hides there. But Sam could not observe him. Taking a chance, Moises pushes Sam and both fall down from the mountain. Both get wounded when they fall down. But Sam's condition was very critical and his rifle was also far from him. When he moves to take it back, Moises snatches it and points rifle on Sam. Moises says to him, you killed my group members deliberately. Sam apologizes to him and requests him, please. Let me go. Then Moises moves from there without killing him. Sam, asks his help. But Moises overlooks him. Then he moves to Adela whose condition was critical. Moises